I live in the greater Toronto area. One of the things that we're known for is just hellish commute times. If you're like me, that's a lot of downtime that can be used more productively. The best way for me personally is to make use of my time by listening to podcasts where I can listen, reflect, be inspired, be challenged to be a better version of myself. Here are my three podcasts that you should listen to this year. Number one, Catholic stuff you should know. Long before Bishop Robert Barron or Father Mike Schmitz came into the picture, these guys were the OG Catholic podcasters. They started the podcast back in 2010 as seminarians and they were ordained somewhere along the way to become priests. The great thing about this podcast is actually the first podcast that I ever listened to that made me realize that priests are regular people. Not only are they legit and authentic and raw, they share their joys, their pains, their struggles, their victories, their journey in their priesthood, and their journey with their parishioners. To me, they are a good example of what a community should be. I love listening to these guys because they banter a lot and throughout that banter you get bits and pieces of wisdom throughout the conversation. Now if you don't like banter then maybe this is not the podcast for you. However, if you like listening and joining into a conversation and then get something out of it, these guys are the best. The best host combo of the podcast is Father Michael O'Loughlin and Father Nathan Goebel because these guys are hilarious. Not only that, Father Michael is actually a Byzantine Rite priest. So every time you listen to him, you get to see a different perspective of what the church believes in. You should definitely check them out. Catholic stuff you should know. The second podcast that you should listen to is the Catholic Talk Show. These guys, based out of Texas, has a simple but effective way of explaining the faith to the listener. They do it point by point, share stories in between, and give their points of view throughout. At the end of the podcast, not only do you have a better understanding of the topic at hand, you also come into a, a greater realization that this faith is so beautiful. You should take a listen to these guys if you want to learn your faith in a simple but effective manner. They also have a YouTube channel if you like watching that, but for me, I prefer the podcast format. That's the second podcast you should listen to. The third, but definitely not the least, podcast that you should listen to is Ask Christopher West. Not only do you get to listen to Christopher West, the best theology of the body speaker, teacher, and expert alive today. You also get to listen to his lovely wife, who I think, and he would agree, is the star of the show, Wendy West. The format of the podcast is a Q&A, where you as a listener get to ask them questions. To me, Christopher and Wendy offer an awesome take on the questions that the listeners get to ask them. They answer the questions philosophically, theologically, and most importantly, practically. So you as a listener get to understand theology of the body better, but better apply it in your life. You should definitely listen to Ask Christopher West. Now, of course, there's still more podcasts to listen to than these guys. But if you'd like to listen, understand, and make use of your downtime in a better way, you won't go wrong with these podcasts. If you have more to share, Comment down below, share it to your friends, subscribe, smash that like button, and share this video. You know the drill. I'll see you next week.